What are some signs of a compatible relationship? Compatibility is based on does this stance, this foundation that this person's standing on match mine? And we don't have to be compatible in every way for the relationship to be successful, for the relationship to have health. But it does determine certain ways in which we will operate within the relationship and in the future. So you need to be able to have those compatibility metrics to know where and how we will operate in the relationship. That's why it's really important to gain knowledge of your compatibility with somebody just for that, just to be able to say, is this a non-negotiable or is this a negotiable where we don't agree on politics? Great. Maybe we can have some really productive conversations around that topic. We don't have a heart that hates people because of their different political beliefs. That's a negotiable for me. Or it's a non-negotiable. If someone believes this politically, I'm out. And you know the reasons why, and they're totally different than yours. Right. That's a non-negotiable. There you go. Compatibility is very important for both of those to know if I can or cannot be with this person. Yeah. So I guess it depends if it's a dating relationship and you're looking towards marriage, there are key things that you need to make sure you're compatible in or it won't work. Your relationship just won't ever work. Right. Yeah. There's key things you need to look into. Mm -hmm. Like any relationship, whether you're looking for a compatible business partner, there's key things in that that they have to match up with you or it's not going to be a successful partnership. Right. Compatibility is to determine if this will work in a marriage context. That's ultimate. That's ultimate. And that's for everybody. I know we have a lot of different relational structures in our culture today where marriage is just one of many relational structures. But that is why you seek compatibility, because you know that you're going to have to exist forever till death do us part with Mm -hmm. this person. And you're going to have to raise children with them. If God right. blesses you with that. Yeah, yeah. You know, and I know that everybody's like, nah, I seek compatibility for my own interests or my own pleasure or my own whatever it is, my own relationship structure. Fine. It's still an important factor. Yeah. But that is its ultimate purpose. We have to be able to align on certain things for this marriage to be successful and for us to teach our kids Well, right. And that's why I said you can have differences of opinion, differences of compatibility if it's negotiable and you guys feel like you can actually negotiate on that non-compatibility issue or not issue. It doesn't even have to be an issue. Just whatever that that context is that you are not completely compatible in. As long as you can negotiate around that, that's fine. I've seen so many marriages where people are not compatible on certain metrics and they do great. Yeah. They do great because they've learned and, and have developed strategies to address that when it's an issue, when right. it's something that they have to. 